I'm Anil Kumar and this is a very interesting question based on chain rule. We have learned that if you have a function, let's say if you have y equals to f of g of x, in that case the derivative will be derivative of the function times derivative of inside function which is this right so that's the formula which is going to be applied in this particular example question is find an expression for derivative of following if f is differentiable so we have three examples here you can copy these questions and then look into my suggestions first one is h of x equals to x cubed plus f of x squared so what is the derivative of this function with respect to x so we can say h prime x is equals to derivative of x cube is 3 x square plus derivative of outside function which is derivative of the function right times derivative of inside function so inside derivative is 2x right so i'll straight away write 2x you would have always add a step here like this derivative of d dx of x squared and then come to this result however this is going to be your answer right so the next one should be equal to now here we have 2x times f of x so we'll do the product rule right so you can say derivative of 2x let's write in steps so we have d dx of let's say 2x times f of x plus 2x times derivative of f of x is that okay so we have applied the product rule here and what we get is derivative of 2x is 2 so we get 2 times f of x plus we get 2x f dash x is it okay so that becomes the derivative so we have applied the product rule now in the last case p derivative will be so we'll do this what we did it's kind of a derivative of the function itself which is x square plus one whole cube right and then derivative of inside function then derivative of x square plus one whole cube do you see that so that should be equals to derivative of x square plus one whole cube times three times x square plus one times derivative of inside function which is 2x so don't forget that so finally we could write our answer as 2 times 3 is 6 6x x square plus 1 times derivative of x square plus 1 whole cube the function itself right so that is how you could find derivative of composite functions i'm Anil kumar and i hope that helps thanks for watching and all the best